Hey everyone, Mick Taylor here. Today we're going to learn how you can connect UiPath test cases to Azure Pipeline, view the results in JIRA, and automatically have your RPA workflows committed to Orchestrator. First, let's look at the user story that I have created in JIRA. I have also created a test case off of that requirement. This test case in JIRA has been connected to the test case that I've created in UiPath Studio Pro. Let's now take a look at that login test case that I've developed in Studio Pro. This test case is going to test some login functionality that I have for my UiBank app. I have a repository that I have created in Git that I can now commit and push my changes to. Next, you can see my changes were committed in Git. Now my Azure Pipeline has recognized the changes in Git and will start performing a new pipeline task. I created this task with the UiPath components that are available for anyone to use. You simply search for the components and the steps you would like to use. For this example, I have used pack test, and deploy steps. Now we can see that the tasks have started and my Azure Pipeline build is underway. It looks like my build failed. That's too bad. Let's go see why it failed. After investigating my logs, you can see that I need to change one of the variables here from false to true. Let's change that and run the build again. I check in my code. And then the pipeline starts again. Let's see how this build runs. It looks like my code worked, the build was successful, and my code has now been deployed to UiPath Orchestrator after I passed all of the tests and I'm good to go.